Hey guys, it's Shan, and today I'm going to be making a review on the Epson Workforce WF100. Now this is a portable printer, meaning that you guys are supposed to be taking it out and going around with it, rather than a stay-at-home printer. So this is more like a secondary printer if you're on the go with your job, or just are a student that wants a printer to take to school and go out a lot. So this printer is very compact and tiny, but can print out any sized pages that you want. It has Wi-Fi built in. It is the smallest and lightest printer in the world. It also has built in wireless and direct Wi-Fi towards your smartphones, laptops, and every device that you have. It has a built in battery letting you not only have it plugged in all the time, but also being able to make it even more portable rather than having it plugged in at all times. You can at least travel with it now and the battery life will last you a long time. It will last you around 100 black pages and 50 colored pages around those times. It also prints 6.7 pages per minute on black and white and 3.8 pages per minute for colored pages. It has a high speed USB to plug in directly to your laptop if you don't want to use wireless connections or there's no Wi-Fi around to connect to. You can easily just plug it in onto your laptop directly and be able to print with no problems. Like I said, it had Wi-Fi and Wi-Fi direct also. If you guys want to use your mobile devices, you guys can use Epson Connect what features the Epson email print, Epson iPrint, mobile app, and Epson remote print. It also has Apple AirPrint, Google Cloud Print, and Kindle Fire Print. Like I said before, it can handle up to any type of papers that you put in it, including the letter sized papers, what is a lot of printers that are mobile, then you can, and portable, that you can bring around, don't actually support letter sized papers, what is quite surprising, but for the compactness of it, they don't usually support it, but the Epson Workforce WF100 does, what is great because it is a business printer and you need to be able to print out the actual letter size papers. It can hold up to 20 sheets of paper, one envelope and five sheets of photo paper. It has a 1.4 inch colored LCD screen for you to see, there's menus and everything so you guys can do everything from within the printer and not only have to use your smartphone and all that, but you guys can use everything on the printer itself, what makes it a lot more easier for some people. It takes around two and a half hours to completely charge the battery from zero to 100%, but it's actually not that bad because you're gonna be carrying it around and get amazing battery life, like I said at the beginning of the video. Now, in quick charge, if you charge it for five minutes, you guys can get up to five black and white prints, what is actually pretty good. The printer features two ink cartridges, what is black and also colored. The colored one will last around 200 pages, while the black ink will last around 250 pages, what is better than most printers that are portable and is a lot of pages, so that means you won't have to replace it too many times the printer does come with a starter kit but it can only print up to around 25 pages so i would recommend buying a new ink cartridge right out right away the main it also has a maintenance box what means every six months to a year around then and depending on the usage you will have to replace it and if you guys don't you won't be able to actually use the printer it's a little bit of extra work but it just how the printer works. The printer also comes with a manual and a CD driver also if you guys want to put right away onto your computer or anything but you guys don't actually have to you guys can just go on the website download it from there go on your phone and just download the app right from there and it's very easy to use. The printer also has four arrow keys and an OK button, a stop button, and back button and a power on and off button. It also has a slot to push up for your cartridges, the feeder tray and how it comes out. It has the powering port, the micro USB port. It also has a battery indicator and a use indicator. And 
it folds down and back up what means it's even more sleek than you guys would actually expect which a lot better in my opinion as you won't have to be carrying a bulky printer and it's very tiny the printer in my opinion is great and I would definitely recommend it to anyone that has a job that they have constantly travel or to any student that has to bring a printer or just anybody that is traveling a lot and needs a printer on the go this is the printer I would recommend for everyone that goes traveling but that's all for the video today guys if you guys did like the video make sure to give it a thumbs up also make sure you guys go ahead and hit that subscribe button down below and follow my social media link down in the description below Make sure you guys also comment what you guys think and what I can improve on down in the comments below. Thank you guys so much for watching and see you guys in the next video.